Hey vloggers, it's Saray. Back at again with another video. Right now I'm sitting on my musty floor because today we're gonna get a little bit arts and crafty. Right now I've been seeing a lot of anime jeans on my TikTok for you page and on Instagram stores. So I really wanted to make my own pair today. Cause you know, I like anime and they also cost like 80 freaking bucks to buy. And let me tell you the process for this video and to get these jeans. These darker ones. Alrighty, let's start painting. My jeans are going to be Naruto themed. It was the first anime I ever watched. These are the photos I'll be referencing to. I have one of Itachi. Then I have Naruto looking weird. Then I have one of Kakashi. Keep in mind, I don't art. I don't know how to paint, I suck at it. This Peppa Pig took like three hours to paint and it's absolutely trash. Here are the jeans. Let's start sketching. You can't even see it. I'm going to use a pen. So I finished sketching out Itachi and I made the executive decision to not draw their faces. I'm really bad at this. Now we're gonna do Kakashi. Oh my gosh, I finished sketching out Kakashi. I tried my best. So I finished sketching out Naruto. Not bad, not bad. Since the lighting in my room is getting quite dang, we're going to move over to the kitchen so we can begin painting. I'm in the kitchen now. What up squad fam? I don't do voiceovers, but I do now. Right now I am painting the white collar, which is really satisfying. Then I did the bottom of the jacket and then the actual jacket, which was really tough because there were just so many small spaces and lines. So I had to be extra careful. And I did the shoulders and then the pockets. And then I also painted the face and the headband area. And then I ran out of time and this is the most I did for that day. So day two. Good morning! It is the second day of painting my Naruto anime jeans. It's 10.58 and I hope to be done painting these jeans around 3 to 4. Right now, I only have Kakashi done and I still need to paint his hair white. After that, I'm gonna move on to black. For anime, right now I am watching Psyche K. Kaguya-sama Love is War. I really like that right now. I am trying to finish Kaguya-sama Love is War. And they have Psyche K on Netflix, which is really cool. Some animes that I have rewatched recently would be Maid-sama and Toradora. I know nobody really cares, but I feel like I should talk a little bit while painting. First three animes actually were Maid-sama, Kokoro's No Basket, and Naruto. I also finished Orange in the beginning of quarantine. I actually read the manga a long time ago. I definitely think the manga is so much better than the anime itself. Just like a bunch of other people, I am waiting for- <coughs> I am waiting for the season ending for Haiku. And now I'm going to move on with the black paint and I'm gonna finish Kakashi hopefully very soon. Whoa, this is so cool. Painting with the black paint was actually pretty easy and fun. So I did the sleeves, and then I did the pants, and then I did the other sleeve. I also painted the face mask with the headband. Then I went with toothpicks and paint to help do fine lines, details, and to help clean areas up. Like right here, I'm doing the fine lines of the pockets, which was really difficult. I used tape to help make the panel lines as well as line the hair. It made everything super nice and straight. And to just finish Kakashi up, I went back and cleaned the areas. I finally finished painting Kakashi. It actually took super long. And I think it's because he has a lot of details. There's the mood, his hair, the lines on his jacket. Again, here is the reference photo. Talking about Naruto, my favorite character probably have to be Kakashi, just like a bunch of other people. I know, I'm basic. I think he's really cool. I also really like Naruto himself. 
I feel like he's a very likable character. Personally for me, I'm not a big fan of Boruto, both the anime and the character. There's so many scenes where I can remember that if I rewatch it and rewatch it, I will still cry. When Naruto had to say goodbye to Minato and send him off. When Raya Sensei died. When Naruto finally met his mother. All right, I painted off camera, did Itachi's vest, and I painted all the wet spots and area. Now I'm gonna go in with black to fix his hair, do the details of his shirt, and fix any fine lines. Itachi was pretty easy to paint. I'm doing his t-shirt, and then I painted his hair, but then I went back to go do his t-shirt. Then I went back to his hair, and then I finished up his coat. Then I went back to his hair again. I went back to his coat to make it more cleaner. And then I finished up his hair and tried to make it more sharp. Unfortunately, I have run out of time, so I'm done painting for today. I finished painting Kakashi today, but I didn't finish painting Itachi. And I still have to paint Naruto. Tomorrow will be another paint day. Hopefully, it will be the last day for Itachi though. I'm so close to finishing. I just need to do the details and sharpen up the edges. Other than that, it's fire. Wow. morning everybody this is the third and hopefully last day of painting these anime jeans right now it is 11 56 and i hope to be completely finished with painting by 4 30 i'm shooting for 4 30 because i also want to go out and take some pictures to show you guys the final product i'm basically done painting itachi i just need to finish painting the rest of his shirt and then after that we're gonna move on to painting naruto right now the jeans already look super sick super cool i really like it i can't wait to add another one but right now this is what it looks like i got my tape ready to go Alright y'all, I finished painting Itachi. He looks absolutely fire. So now it's finally time to paint Naruto. Alrighty, so I'm starting off with the hair which was super satisfying to paint if you can't tell. Super fun and pointy. Then I started working on the other white areas like the headband, the pants, the stuff he's holding, and the thing on his sleeve. I'm done painting all the white parts of Naruto, so now I'm going to go in with the black paint. Painting the sleeves of the black paint was quite easy, and then I used a quill tip to be more precise and for more details. I painted the shirt, the other sleeve, and then I painted the shoes. Here's a good look of the process right now. I went in with white and cleaned up some lines. Then I started doing his headband, which was kind of difficult. I used the quill tip for the details of the pants, and then I went back with tape to do the hair. Ooh, that one's so nice. It looks so clean. Oh my God, it looks so nice. Lines for the hair are pretty clean actually. Alrighty, so I finished painting Naruto finally. I just finished the framing and it looks super clean and neat, but I still have to add the bench he's sitting on and I still have to add the Leaf Village headband. So let's do that real quick right now. Oof, that's really ugly. That one's a bit better. I am fish. 
finished. I am finished with the jeans. This is what each of them look like. We have Itachi. Then we got Kakashi. Then we got Naruto. Alright y'all, so I'm done painting the animated jeans. It took forever. It is 6 p.m. now. I'll insert videos and photos of the finished end results. up because I spent like three days on it. I'll see y'all in the next one. I can't reach so...